Yo, what's up? So this YouTuber has 1.8 million subscribers, but his videos only have 60 views? What? Before I made this video, I didn't know about the world of fake subscribers on YouTube. But I'm not just gonna talk about these YouTubers in this video. I'm gonna find them, I'm gonna message them, and I'm gonna ask them why they have fake subscribers and how they got them. I hope these YouTubers don't get too mad at me. So my first ever experience that I had with somebody who I thought had fake subscribers on their channel was about five months ago, and his name was Communic Gaming. I came across his channel one day and I had a quick look. 1.4 million subscribers, 50 to 100,000 views per video, that's not bad. But I noticed something weird. Here is right now. That will leave you mind blown. The zero point is evil. The weird part isn't his voice. It's the fact that this video has 50,000 views and only 50 comments. Hmm. And the comments are weird. In the original video that I made about this guy where I talked about him, I ended up finding his Twitter account and I asked him why he has no comments on his videos and I asked him if he buys subscribers, but he never ended up answering me and we just had to move on. Well, guess what? He finally texted me back and he said this. I don't view bot and the reason why I have so little comments is because I don't heart the comments and I don't leave pinned comments. He also said that there's a ton of scam comments on his videos and he tries to remove them so that's why he doesn't have a bunch of comments. But do we believe him? I guess I do. His channel seems legit but he just doesn't get a lot of comments. But this next channel, I'm almost 100% sure that they buy their subscribers. Have you heard of the channel Trop Games? Yeah, probably not. That's a good thing though. This person has 48,000 subscribers, but look at this. The last eight videos that they've posted are all the same, and it looks like this. This is horse poop, bro. This is the worst video I've seen in a while. How did they convince 48,000 people to subscribe to them? I went all the way back to the first ever videos that this person uploaded and it's just random Minecraft videos. But none of these videos even have over a thousand views. The most popular video on this person's channel has 5,000 views, that's all. The subscriber to view ratio isn't adding up. I mean, the channel literally has a total of 47,000 views but they have 48,000 subscribers. It is not possible to have more subscribers than you have views. But who is this Trop Games person? Who is the person behind this YouTube channel? I need to talk to them and I need to ask them about this. I looked through about 40 of these crappy videos that they made to try to find any social medias that this person has and I found nothing. But I did comment on their community post and told them to message me on Twitter. Let's see if they answer me. The next channel is probably one of the funniest things I've witnessed on YouTube. The channel name is Ayers, and the profile picture is a frog in a hoodie. I mean, that seems normal, right? Well, this person has 319,000 subscribers, but they're live streaming right now. And they're live streaming to only one person watching? What? And this is what their live stream is. No wonder it's dead. He's constantly spamming the live stream chat with, Oh, click this link to become a member. Boy, who would want to be a member of your crappy channel? And then I realized something. This guy has three live streams going on at the exact same time. How is that even possible? Wait, am I tripping? Does, does this live stream say 1,607 hours long? Wait, his other live stream has been going on for 7,278 hours? That's 303 days. That's when I realized that this dude's channel is full of crap. It's fake live streams that are looped over and over and over again, and that's where he gets his subscribers. Okay, I have to figure out who's behind this channel. In all of his videos, he never talks at all, but in his first ever videos, he did talk. Look at this. This video is gonna be uh, from the spawn, and the aim for you viewers, so this kid is six years old looping these fake live streams? That is hilarious. When I was six years old, I was rolling around in the mud outside. Okay, so now we know that this kid is six years old, but how can I talk to this kid? How can I ask him about these fake live stream and fake subscribers? I looked through 20 of these stupid videos, I regret it, and he didn't have any social media links in his descriptions. But in this one video, he linked his Twitter in the description. 
I went ahead and messaged him and I asked him why he loops these live streams and I asked him how he feels about having basically fake subscribers all over his channel. He's probably not gonna answer me right now because he's like six and he has a bedtime. I found the next YouTuber completely on accident. I was looking around YouTube and I saw a video that Dream posted and I thought, you know what? I never really watched this guy. Why not just click on it? But when I went to the comments, the top comment was from a channel that said subbing to everybody who subs to me. That's their channel name. What a stupid channel name, bro. And that's when I realized that this channel had 321,000 subscribers. Are you serious? But this wasn't like one of those normal sub for sub channels. This channel was a little different. The videos on this channel looked like some Mario and Luigi stuffed animal type videos and his channel banner even said DJ Mario Bros. Wait, hold up. Please don't tell me this dude's name is DJ2. Oh my god, I'm changing my name. I scrolled all the way to his first video just to see what he was like before he started doing this subscribe stuff and this is what the video is. Okay Luigi, I'm gonna eat some Taco Bell. Okay. So, I'll be right back in the next 10 minutes. Okay. Can't wait to eat some Taco Bell. Whoa! Mario, are you okay? <laughs> Speak! Is this dude playing with stuffed animals? I mean, I'm not judging him. People can do whatever they want on YouTube. I don't really care. But he has 320,000 people subscribed to him to watch stuffed animals flop around on video? Uh, 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 Mario! Mario! Uh, what a nice day at the beach. What? Oh my god, my friend Yoshi is drowning! Oh my god, I, I gotta save him, I gotta save him! Yeah, I don't believe this. The title of his most recent video is Like the video, subscribe to me, and comment done. So this dude changed his channel name and profile picture to try to get more subscribers? That is so lame. But I want to talk to this stuffed animal lover. I want to ask him why he's doing this. I couldn't find a Twitter or Instagram link in any of the descriptions of his video, so I tried to do the next best thing. If you remember, if we look at his banner, his real name is DJ Mario Bros, so I looked up that name on Twitter, I didn't really expect to find anything, and wow. This stuffed animal lover has been doing some horrible things for a long time. I found a tweet that somebody made a while ago that said that this guy constantly changes his name from DJ Mario Bros to subscribe to my channel and he goes on to popular YouTubers comment sections and he either hates on them, he says some corny stuff just writing them, or he replies to people's comments saying read my name. This dude is so lame. He's changing his channel name, changing all his content, doing all this just so he can get a few new subscribers just for his videos to get no views. Why don't you go back to playing with stuffed animals, bro? Stop changing your channel name. So one of the YouTubers actually just texted me back. So the guy that I texted was the Ayers guy. That was the dude who was like live streaming Minecraft for 250 days straight. He was just looping the live streams. I texted him and I said, answer me ASAP. And he replied back to me with a question mark. So I answered him. I said, hey, how does it feel to loop those live streams over and over? And how does it feel to have fake subscribers? And guess what he said? He didn't say anything. He literally blocked me. So this guy blocked me. The other YouTubers with fake subscribers just straight up ignored me. And I think it's because they're guilty. I mean, if I had fake subscribers on my YouTube channel, I would be embarrassed too. I would never talk to anybody about it. All of these YouTubers in this video are so annoying, but they're not as annoying as the YouTubers in this video. So you can go ahead and check that video out. We looked at the most annoying YouTubers ever.